This was definitely the, the most important journey that I've been a part of. It was a struggle, uh, constantly being kind of in the background and just wanting an opportunity to prove myself, but not necessarily knowing the steps that it took to get there. Initially in high school, that recruiting process was very difficult, just given the fact that I didn't receive any offers. I didn't really receive much attention. Can't touch the bottom. Sit into a tumble. Waves that shake me out. My first two years, I was just grateful to be on this team where I wasn't seeing any court time and I wasn't even seeing much practice time in terms of the scrimmages. I wasn't in that lineup much. I was mostly on the sides wiping up sweat or being a line ref. And that was when, when I was really at a, at a point where I felt discouraged. I was waiting in the undertow Set a drift who fed away like bones Unaware of where my heart would flow I was waiting in the undertow I knew that I just wasn't strong, and every time I stepped into the weight room, I always saw people and individuals that were stronger than I was, and it was embarrassing for me to step into that position. I really just decided that I wanted to work, and I was willing to put in the work. That was where the switch flipped, where I just kind of learned to fall in love with the process of working hard, and I learned that when, when, when hard work repeats itself over and over and over, day in and day out, it's rewarded, and I committed to that process and I, I made the decision that I really wanted to, to step onto the court. When I started to make strength gains and vertical jump improvements and whatnot, um, I was just really willing to put in that work and just see how far I could go. There's a lot of external noise created by those that have doubts and opinions, and it's really important to, at times, tune those out and just focus on what you can control. The people that have supported me along the way and given me opportunities and I think that's just what I'm going to miss most is because I couldn't have made this journey by myself. I'd like to be remembered as, as someone that, that chose to do the right things consistently. Just someone that was willing to tough it out and someone that was willing to work really hard and never really gave up on themselves.